I like it. Look into the soul to embrace the mind. Because we create the future at will. Nothing, I mean nothing will change if we just stand still. Brothers through our history warned about the future of the years of miseducation. Marcus Garvey, Malcolm X, now Obama bear witness of lack of preparation. Never get intelligence rules the world. And ignorance will carry her burden. Our mistakes are embedded in the past, but there's new hope for our children. Uh, change is only as strong as weakest link. And my child will be the one that's broken. Her blood will flow as black as her skin, not like one of those tokens. There's no lack of abundance of food because knowledge is constantly passed by. And speaking while lying on your belly, but well, there's no weak way, no way we can see fucking eye to eye. See, I give you what God gives to me, and I cast the first stone that lands in your mind. If it gets rippling over and over again, these are effects from so much suffering over time. Your witness to the calm before the storm, the breaking silence that will start a war. One voice rising above the hypocrisy. Somebody give it to you raw. So you gotta stand up and you want something better. And greater than your goddamn self. And stand up if you hold a ladder while your family eats top shelf. Let me tell you, that's a terrorist in a presidential limo. That seal with bulletproof glass. They are terrorists yeah. teaching in public schools, and they letting the failures pass. They are terrorists on bending knees every Sunday, yes. and they receiving holy mass. Yes. They are terrorists terrorizing y'all. Yes. How long we let terror last? Mm -hmm. Because if you're not doing the right thing for your people, then you're doing dead wrong. We can talk all we want to and sing those same songs. We shall overcome. That's the national anthem for the urban plantations. Free at last, free at last. How we free a hypnotized black population? Let me tell you, in 1776, America declared independence. But Africans remained enslaved. The next time independence is declared in the streets, it will be with guns and grenades. We had black walls freaking Tulsa. And I found this fat white rail. The first economic achievement by blacks was the first U.S. city ever dynamited from the air. This is black history in the wake of message. And I'm giving it to you in the form of spoken word. It's a gift of wisdom and boy at first because every one of you deserves. You deserve a piece of land. You deserve a piece of peace. You deserve a place to fulfill this temporary existence. But ignorance is just like a fence you see through, but still yields a strong resistance. Old barriers weaken, old walls fall once a year to celebrate our blackness. Wow. Africans, we were giants amongst men. Yes. Now great is our sin and sadness, because everyone wants to free their own ass. Yes. But who wants to free their fucking mind? We became our own oppressors, and this was planned by a wicked design. There was a document called Let's Make a Slave. And it was discovered in the Southern Courthouse Basin. It had detailed methods for destroying the people through years of torture and displacement. Understand when the European first saw our colored skin, it literally drove him insane. He knew the world like an egg would crack, that the white could run out and only the color would remain. God master read me one request. With my last breath, let me witness change. So I can leave this world with assurance that my last spark ignites a flame. And anyone who wants to become fueled to the fight, he got to rise up himself and make it hotter and become what our race really needs, an army of fire starters.